What's going on YouTube? It's been a while since I made another video. Today I got the four Android TV remotes and one bonus remote I will show you today. Right now I'm showing you the iPassport Apache Bluetooth keyboard. It uses two AAA batteries and it has a USB dongle and it's Bluetooth and it has a touch pad up and down left and right it has a volume button underneath with the Bluetooth search button and the Bluetooth search button uses the function key with Bluetooth button right now we have the Minex Neo A2 Lite wireless remote comes with a dongle has no bluetooth and it's a double sided keyboard with remote with a 6 axis gyroscope so if there's a video game with a gyroscope in it where you can move the plane or drive a car I'll demonstrate it in another video how each remote works with Android probably bring up the original Google TV and update it and let's see how it will work with it so it has a compartment two compartments for the batteries two AA batteries and it comes with a USB dongle which you connect to a PC or your Google TV devices or even um, television you can connect to your Sony TV if it has Google on it and it will still work your TV it's got a nice little weight to it I guess that's for the gyroscope it needs weight comes with an instruction manual shows you all the different Neo batteries, Neo remotes and Android boxes it's compatible with. And that's it. Next up is the Vontel Air Mouse which is a 2.4 gigahertz wireless keyboard with dongle, double sided and has no Bluetooth has an on and off switch and built in batteries for charging with a micro USB cable and the packaging is nice um, the dongle does not fit inside of the remote there's no space for it but you could also you could always attach it with velcro and here's the micro USB cable for charging and here's the remote has regular remote on one side and QWERTY keyboard on the back with function keys for extra keys It's a nice remote, feels good in the hand. Okay, up next. We have the RE i8 Bluetooth mini wireless keyboard with Bluetooth, has backlight, touchpad, a big touchpad, keyboard and dongle. It's always good to get a dongle just in case your TV or your computer 
or your Android box doesn't come with a Bluetooth I believe the earlier Android boxes never came with um, Bluetooth built in but you could always attach Bluetooth dongle to the USB ports but most of these keyboards come with a USB dongle and you have left right mouse compatible backlight on off switch space bar has the full functions of a regular keyboard and it had both sides of function keys up and down where you can actually play a little mini video game up next is the Logitech mini controller so it comes it came around the same time the original Google TV by Logitech that was one of their additional keyboards for the unit so as you can see it comes with a battery pack and a USB dongle a unifying Logitech dongle most of you have the unifying dongles with the keyboards and mouses and the keyboard comes in a clamshell to protect the keyboard it has like a touch mouse pad on the side nice rubber keys for the QWERTY keyboard and underneath is where the battery pack goes in and it has a space for the USB dongle it's a real nice product definitely will be demonstrating that one in the next video so stay tuned for the next video please subscribe and like video and that's it I hope you enjoyed the video you could see different Android remotes you, you can get for your Android remote TVs and hopefully I see you in the next one when I demonstrate it thank you very much for watching goodbye